Yeah, YouTubers, Tazman here, bringing you another episode of Stoneblock. <laughs> Sorry, I've been pretty busy. Uh, hit the wrong key, I stopped my recording. Look, I can look at him. Oh, if you look down at the bar, you might notice I'm actually in creative. Uh, that's because this is not my actual world. Uh, this is... Uh, a testing world, I guess, but it's a replica of my world. And as you can see, I dug out this giant room. Uh, in my other world, I don't think it's quite this big. Um, but uh, <laughs> we we did dig up uh, in the other world, and we have like a path that goes over that way. But we didn't dig all this. But here's what I wanted to show you. This is going to be for our chickens. And if you look over here, boom, ah, kind of ugly, but that's going to be our little farm. <laughs> and as you can see in here, or our barn, I have all the chickens in here. These now, these are just level one chickens, but I just kind of wanted to see how they did and how they fit and stuff like that. So kind of to replicate maybe a little more what having 10 10 10 chickens was in here i also did these i don't know if you've seen these things are completely op they speed up the ticks a bunch um when you <laughs> click it like that uh, it makes the the tick tick count go up insanely high uh but as you can see here we have what they're all doing they're doing their pooping of stuff it's going into this chest as a buffer um, and then being sucked out and put into our uh, controller here, which in turn puts it in all these things. I was slowly looking at it and figuring out um, what things I want to have uh, the uh, drawer, comp the compacting drawers in. Um, and a, a weird thing, I don't know if you know this, but if you're in creative and you have these drawers, you can't break them unless you do it from the side so there's a lot actually can I well I can't see from the back what's in them so I don't want to well, I guess I could I don't know I just wanted to kind of get an idea cuz so if I turn on these uh, four watches in here and I don't know how close this is gonna simulate um, I don't know the range of these things, to tell you the truth. I don't know a ton about them um, other than they speed up the tick. So now these chickens, if we look at them, they're just going much, much, much quicker for 111 chickens. And if we come over here and we look at our, our chest, it, it's filling up really fast. So there's a couple things I'm a little nervous of setting up this system. Everything I have here, we should actually be able to do. Look at that. <laughs> so funny. Uh, everything that's in uh, that we're using here, I think we should be able to do. We have this Singulum chicken, sig Signalum chicken or whatever. So we should be able to do that. Um, we have uh, these resonant uh, servos, which we should be able to do because we actually have the ability to make an ender chicken. But uh, we don't have him yet. But yeah, when these are all on, they come in real fast. Now, one thing I was looking at on this is there's some things in here I might not want all 10, 10, 10, 10 chickens in. Like the dyes, for example. Really, I don't think we need that much dye. So maybe only have a couple or maybe one of the 10, 10, 10 chickens in there. Um, other things like sand, uh, I don't really think think we're gonna need boatloads of and we still have like the gold nuggets right now I actually have two gold chickens in the setup over there but we also have the endurium nuggets the draconium nuggets so we might actually want to have more chickens of those I don't know um, it's gonna be I definitely don't want cocoa beans uh, so I might not even put that chicken in there because we get those from our trees um, let's see what else is in here uh, da, da. nether wart like that we don't need boatloads of because all we do is grow that for making uh, potions eggs don't really care too much about but I, I would like uh, ink sacks definitely not but as you can see even with 
all four of those watches on. This is kind of keeping up. These water and fire chickens, uh, lava chickens. Unless, I know you can use these as buckets in recipes, but I don't know if you can actually like have something, fill something using the egg. Well, the walk tests that. Uh, awakened Draconium, probably want that to have more than one chicken. So we have some things that we want more than one chicken. We have other things where I don't think we even care about having so many chickens. But I wanted to show you this setup real quick. Uh, just so you can kind of see how we've got it set up. Now I know you can use, like, there's something that automatically gathers from the chickens, like a, another thing, and then you could just plug in that. I think I want these because they're going to be a lot quicker. But as you can see, we have all our chickens kind of interconnected. So everything they're pooping out is going into the system. Uh, one problem I ran into is, uh, yeah, you, you saw this guy. That is our, uh, our main area. So when I build this barn in the other one, I might actually make the front of it. Like maybe make this area right here right here ish so right there will be that part which will uh, a lot us another couple the other option is actually putting the barn on this wall but the problem with that is it won't give us much room for expansion in the future so I kind of want to just bring it out like three blocks this way and then that will allot us plenty of space then we can even set up this area right here so that we can um, have our other chickens we could actually have the duplicate chickens but so that's one thing I was thinking of the other thing like here if I do this exactly as is the reason we have these steps right here is because right here is our other area <laughs> so we needed to kind of step up here so like here we have that and so on and so forth so um, by pushing it all out three blocks that way will also give us space to have all our piping over here. Seems like it'll be pretty good. <clears throat> but now that this thing's been slowed back down, you can see it's having no problem keeping up. We could make a crystal chest as a buffer still here just because it looks cool, but we really don't need that. Um, but we really don't need that. It just kind of looks cool. So I might still do it. But I, the other thing I was thinking about is like actually maybe setting up a couple different systems. So as you can see here, we're having everything and it's piped into our system. We use the, um, whatchamacallit here. Boom, boom, boom. We use this uh, external storage, which lets it connect up to our system here. So now we can actually click on this guy and we can actually see all our stuff. This is all only what our chickens are providing us. So they actually provide us lots. And as you can see, it's sorted right now by amount. And like we've just got boatloads of rose red, uh, bone mill, green, flint. We're getting tons of ink sacks. So a lot of the stuff I don't think we need. And I kind of would like to maybe have a couple systems which will make it so the 10 10 10s will actually be more productive where we'll have one going into a chunk that has maybe like the inks and then one that has or the dyes not the inks one that has maybe the ingots and then one that has miscellaneous so we'll have giant walls but not quite as big as this that are individualized so we'll have like one that's just all the ingots they'll all go into the same system through through the uh, cabling and stuff but all we'll have to have going into this controller for example will be all the ingot type chickens or ones that make ingots and stuff so that kind of seems like a good idea let me know what you guys think about the barn I kind of wanted to make it look good and I wanted to use as little light as possible so I kind of hid all the torches back behind here to to get rid of spawning uh, locations for mobs and I think it looks pretty good it kind of gives it a nice uh, uh, lighting effect I think um, but we might have to put some others in some places kind of looks like a schoolhouse but these are like the barn doors that slide open these ones wouldn't slide very far would they maybe we should take those ones out 
that. And then we could extend this guy over. That would actually make it look like those barn doors slide a lot further, which they probably would need to. But I, I think it looks okay. Like I said, I'm not a builder, but I think I did an okay job. I didn't finish up the roof in here, but I do like having uh, half slabs up there to uh, make it look like this part right here is uh, you know more of a half support beam kind of thing. I think that looks kind of nice. But I would really like your guys' opinion on this. Um, I think what we'll do, uh, so this, uh, we're only, what are we at, 10 minutes? We're about halfway through our thing. Oh, and there was this guy, of course. Our, um, <laughs> our smell tree ended up being right here. I didn't even think about that. It's kind of interesting because right where I decided to put this floor was this top block. Oops was that top block right there <laughs> um so it was kind of fate i guess that it, i put it just perfect there but yeah so anyway um when we come back we'll actually be in our real world and we'll probably maybe just make a couple more components to this maybe make more cable um i can show you i made a couple more chickens uh and the reason for that i don't know if i have them in here Actually, I probably don't have them in here. Oh, actually, I do. They're over here. I was digging all this out, and I actually made a, a couple more chickens. I had to make the ardite, the cobalt, so that I could make the manilium ones. So I actually made my tools so they're manilium now. Uh, just because, like, the flint one was breaking every 30, 40 blocks. And that was irritating. These guys actually can dig pretty good. Um, I also had the hammer, but I didn't, I could actually upgrade my hammer probably and fix it now that we have invar chickens. So I'm going to go ahead and go for now. And, uh, uh, well, I guess we're going to jump into our other world. So for you, it'll be pretty much transparent, but for me, it'll be just a little bit because I have some other things I have to do. So thank you guys. Uh, for any of your comments in advance just because when I do the other episode I'll probably forget that but thank you for your comments and uh, ideas and stuff like that that's a future thanks and uh, I will see you guys in a minute and we're back so as you can see um, I haven't gotten quite so far in this world as I did in my creative one because in the creative one, right, I'm actually like four blocks higher than here. So, blech. <laughs> but you can see I did mention that I did upgrade my flint pickaxe to manilium. And I've been putting all the stone I've been getting into here. So now we actually have 28 stacks. Um, yeah. Oh, I have three Enderman heads. So, uh, like I said, one thing I wanted to do probably in this episode is um, actually kind of get some more of our, our components ready. So over here, did I actually, I thought I put a Manilium chicken. No, I thought, I thought about it, but I didn't actually do it. So I was going to put a Manilium chicken in a roost somewhere, but... I didn't do it because while we were breeding it up, we actually got a fair amount of ingots. So we should be able to fix our pick. Of course, I could make the manilium. I don't know. Uh, so anyway, some of the plans here will be... Um, well, we're going to go ahead and make some of these components that we need. So if we go look at the storage, uh, the external... What was it called? External storage? Uh, EXTI and the external storage. Yes, that guy right there. Uh, shoo, oh, poop. Oh, no. Not shulkers. Oh, wait. External storage. Oh, good, we can just use chess. I was like, no, not shulkers. All right, so we need to make these three cores. We need some of our quartz enriched iron. So I'm thinking we're going to need a few of these. 
Um, so let's go grab from our, our hard worker over here. I mean, look at all this quartz of rich iron. Can I uh, put this? One, three. Look at that. 32, 64, 32, 64. Um, three, I need three more. One, two, three. Looks like it's emptied out everything up there, so he's now back to his little three poops. Uh, I can make this into blocks, right? Uh, wrong thing. Uh, yes, perfect. Because I want to maybe just at least uh, do only two of those right now. And that way we can keep a bunch of them. Okay, so what we want to do is start working on this guy. So we're going to need... <sighs> Let's see. So we're going to have our chickens up there. We're going to have probably our uh, all our bonsai. We're going to actually end up putting like every tree we possibly can also into our storage system. Um, using drawers. So we're going to want to have... Although I guess we'll have to check with Pam's Harvest. Uh, this tree is a Pam's Harvest Craft, right? The apple tree is. Bonsai trees. So the question is, do I have another apple sapling tree thingy? I guess we could just make one and see. Because if it's Pam's Harvest Craft, that would mean that we could actually have all the Pam's trees. Because I'd kind of like to, you know, yeah, that's definitely Pam's Harvest Craft. So I, I'd like to have like one of every tree sapling uh, on bonsai pots piping into uh, drawers. So kind of the same thing we have up there where it'll take the wood if it's the same type of wood and either put it jungle or uh, oak. And I don't think the Pam's ones actually take any others. But then we'd also have these special woods and stuff. But I, I'd really like to kind of get it so that, you know, we just have an all-in-one inclusive storage. And it's basically just right, well, part of it's right there because we don't go up very high. <laughs> um, but I, I think that would be kind of cool. And then, like, one for, so we'd have one for, or, oh, we might actually have to have more than one. Like, we'd have all the Pam's Harvest Crafts ones which I think there's 27 saplings then we would have like these other ones um, maybe and then we'd have our mob drops we'd have loot bags uh, results now that's probably what's mostly going to go into our system would be the random junk from loot bags but I want to keep things like the armor the leather armor the uh, chest movers that are wood iron and gold out of the system I don't think we need those um, and some other things so let's go ahead and start working on these storage buses the booses so in order to do that we need a bunch of chests and I don't think I have a bunch I mean I could always cut down my chests in there and probably will at some point but we're not gonna do that right now so let's just make maybe 128 uh, 128 planks, so 16 chests. So that will give us eight. We're making eight storage buses right now. That seems like a pretty good amount. So we have three of those, and then we just have to work on these other guys. That ain't too bad. Uh, where were these? These were like there and there. I guess I could. I'm missing stuff, so I can't do it. And then we have the ingots here, and here, and here, and four, five, six, seven, eight. Wait, did I do that wrong? Oh, I didn't get enough of these, did I? Huh. That's okay. We're really close, though. So let's just grab another one of these. Like so. And go back in here and go five, six, seven, eight, five, six. Oh. I'm counting one higher than I should. All right, so there's those. So the next thing we need is we need these cores and we need some cable. We made cable, didn't we? Do I have that cable? Or did we use all of it? So we have a basic processor still. I think we need this silicon for what we're going to be doing. 
We have an advanced presser. Maybe we'll use that guy up. So we're going to want eight of each of these bad boys. And I don't think I don't think I put them in Jimmy's chest. Yeah, I don't I don't think we have any. Unless I put them in my Ender pouch. Bloop. Uh, no. Oh, I think I did these guys just to get the the quest work. Do we have any cool That's one other thing we should probably do really quick. See if we have any quests. I'm just going to put them all in here because I don't care. Um, do we have any quests that we haven't finished up? Uh, that don't look like it. Power generation, no. 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 Yeah. Alright, so we don't have any quests, so let's go ahead and make up these cables. And I can't remember the recipe for the life of me. Um, we need six redstone so I say let's make nine so we're gonna need 18 glass uh, nine is that right so if I go like this go one two three four five six seven eight nine oh nine I think that should do that part and then I think I think, uh, I don't know if I have uh, 18. Where's my, all my chat, all my uh, crafting pencils are gone now. Uh, so if we do that, that's nine. Oh, that's all of them. Why was I thinking something else? So now we need, oh, I know why. Uh, so we need 18 of those and nine of those. So we can do that real quick. It'll be so nice once we have all this stuff. We won't have to run all the way across the world just to get stuff. Oh, it'll be so nice. Um, I think... That's another thing I'd like to do is maybe look into a redstone furnace. Actually, didn't I try and just see if we... Oh, it's over here. Uh, glass, 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 glass. We don't have any glass. Ooh, bummer. All right, so let's, did we have the sand over here? We'll take the sand with us, 51 sand. We'll just go ahead and take a stack of sand and we'll start that smelting up while we get the rest of the stuff going. So we're gonna need a little more sand, which should be here, boom, like that, perfect. Yeah, we should look into, I, it's kind of funny because right now in my regrowth series that I'm doing, we're actually looking into ME storage, which I kind of like the refined storage a little better because you don't have to worry about channels, or at least as far as I know. Um, it seems to not have quite as many restrictions as the uh, other one. So that's kind of nice. Uh, let's get one more of these. At least to get us started. So go ahead and put that there. Boom, boom. We got 12 of them. That will do for now. Let's go see what else we need. We need to get these construction cores, which is basic processor. So we're going to need a boatload of these, which is raw basic processor, which is the silicon, the processor binding, which is slime. Okay, so maybe we should do a stack of that. Oh, that gives us eight. That'll give us eight stacks. That should last us a while, right? Maybe we'll do half a stack. So we need basically a one stack of string, uh, which we have right here. Because if we do that, that's half a stack. And then uh, half a stack of slime. And go and put that one back. And now, of course, I don't have a crafting table. <laughs> I need to put so many more crafting tables all over. Uh, didn't I have one over here? No. Where's my next crafting table? Oh, can we craft in this thing? Yes, we can. Okay, beautiful. So we do that, that. Oh, look, we had 12 glass. Oh, we have a bunch of those, too. Beautiful. Well, let's start putting this stuff in here. There we go. So we got those. There's plenty of those things now. What else did we need for these? Uh, basic processor. We need to smelt them. So we need iron ingots. We have tons of that, I believe. Silicon, which we get. We actually, do we have the? 
We have to have that that chicken, right? I thought there was another way to get it though. You get it from loot bags, it looks like. <sighs> and I think there might have been some in there. I, I I'm just curious if we also have the silicon chip and so let's it was a silicon. There we go. And we sure do. Alright, so we'll go ahead and throw that in here. So we have 31 of those. We actually have, actually, what? Hold on. Was I looking at the wrong one? I think I did that last time, didn't I? Where we were looking at the wrong one. So it's this small, oh, actually, it looks like any of it works. Okay, we need redstone. So I have some redstone blocks in here, just one. So let's just, I'm just going to go grab a bunch and we're going to throw it into the system. Uh, one, two, three. <laughs> so perfect all right so now we got lots of redstone in there this disk drive should be yeah 64k storage we're good for a while uh let's see so what else we needed iron oh actually we could do this too uh yep why not uh do that that put in the, oh we actually have more silicon uh da, da, da. let's see so we need iron right so for this guy and this guy so now we need some iron and i think i have a ton of iron right oh baby yeah we do so let's just go ahead and throw that in there i think it'll be best if we undo it because we don't have any um, compa compacting drawers in here. All right, so what we need to do is one of those. Uh, was it one of those? And then it could be either of these. We have 50 of those ones. And a dab of redstone like that. So that gives us our basic route processors. And we're going to need a boatload of these, right? So let's just go ahead and maybe do... 32. All right, we'll go up here. Whoops, go up here. Got some apples. Got some more apples. Holy cow, I got a lot of apples. I guess I'm putting apples in my system next. Uh, so let's go ahead and do this and do one, two, three, four. That should be 32. And cook those up because we're going to need lots of those. Throw those in there. Oh, it'll be so nice when we have this up and running. I am excited. Especially because we have the silicone chicken, so that'll be good. All right, so what else do we need for this? Uh, we need the construction core, so we're going to need glowstone. I think we already have the glowstone chicken, so we're good there. We're going to need quartz. We have that chicken as well. And we have... Wait a minute. That... Oh, it's gold. Okay, so we need gold. So well, we definitely have gold. <laughs> beautiful so if we come back here we're gonna need glowstone I don't know how much we have oh we have plenty let's go and take that too uh, we need do 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 we have quartz I see quartz in here I don't see quartz in here but we do definitely have the gold we need so maybe we'll just grab a stack of oh stack of gold oh i can't see it very well but there we go hopefully that did that nope we didn't hit it and boom there we go so a stack of gold blocks we'll go ahead and do that break them down perfect all right so let's go throw these in the system and then i think we have nether quartz in our other chest and we should be able to build up those processors so uh, if we're doing a stack that doesn't divide evenly by three can I do this oh beautiful I can uh, do that 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 uh, go and throw those in there okay so we're gonna have a bunch of these guys coming out perfect oh, we're over time already dang it with that other episode thing all right, so let's focus on building one of these guys, and then I'll do the rest offline. But I just wanted to show you the process. Uh, so we got that. So let's see, can we actually do this guy? 
Yes, we got that guy. Uh, can we do this guy? Oh, I don't have the quartz in here yet. But I think I have a ton of quartz, right? Uh, this chest? Oh, baby. Yeah. Yes, we do. Uh, so I'll go ahead and throw the quartz in there. All right, so let's go back here again. Uh, this guy, we can go ahead and plus him and go ahead and throw that in there. And then finally, this guy, which is that guy, which I don't think we can make him yet. Oh, actually, yeah, we can. Boom. Uh, I'm going to make a couple of these, maybe 16. I will end up using them at some point, so it's not a big deal. Uh, go ahead and do that. Boom, boom. Two of those. And I guess we could actually even do this. Boom, boom. Like show. Like a show, like a pro. Um, and then, let's see, grab those eight out. We should have a bunch of these now. So that's those. And boom. So now let's see, can we make it? Yes, we can. How many can we make? Probably just one. Yes, because we're missing everything else. So there we go. We just made our external storage. That is going to be the first part. So what I'm going to try and do at least is start uh, digging out that area up there. Uh, as we discussed uh, in our previous uh, section, I guess. Um, and I'm probably going to make a bunch more of these storage buses because I think we're just going to need a bunch. Uh, I don't think we'll need 16, but it seems like these components we need all over the place. And our chickens are making all the stuff we need for these. I might have to go set up like the silicon chicken. Maybe the glowstone chicken. The quartz is fine right now. Uh, but yeah, so we might have to do some of that stuff. So thank you guys so much for watching. Hopefully you enjoyed it. If you did, be sure to leave a thumbs up down below. Aside from that, comment, like, and subscribe. Follow me on Twitter. Check out my Discord and my other channels. And don't forget about my great big game giveaway. <laughs> when I hit 1,000 subs, I'm giving away 57 Steam games. And when I hit one, uh, when I hit uh, 500 subs, I'm going to be giving away one Steam game to a lucky subscriber, uh, $60 value. And that's it. I'm Ramblon, so I'm going to go ahead and go now. So until next time, I'll be seeing you later. Bye.